In this video, we will see how to use the chat feature of the cursor AI editor. And in the last video, we have already seen how to use the composer feature of this editor. So first of all, to invoke the chat on keyboard, we have to press command and L. And if you are on Windows, then it would be control and L. So this will open this chat like this. And this is the drop down of models. So from here, you can change the model. And this drop down will show you all the models which are enabled in the cursor settings, which we have already seen in the earlier videos. So for now, I will keep this cloud a 3.5 sonnet. Now this chat option is used for multiple cases. Like let's say if we want to ask some question about our code or let's say we want some advice for our code and then we can even apply that suggested changes in our code. So this was our index.html which we had designed in the previous video. So this was the login page. So let me show you first how it looks like. So I'll right click and say reveal in finder and I will open this from here. So this is how it looks like currently. Now we will ask some questions about the code. So I'll again go to the cursor. So this is my prompt. What is the background color of my login page? So let's hit enter. So it is saying looking at the provided HTML code, there is no explicit background color defined in the HTML file itself. So it did not give the exact answer here. Okay, so I got it. It did not give the answer because it took the index.html as the context. So we will have to edit this or let's copy this from from here and I will again give here and this time I will add the context and I will give the style.css okay so let's give all the files and I will ask the same prompt here let's see if it can give the answer this time so this time it gave the answer based on the provided CSS file your login page has two relevant background colors so the overall page background is this a light grayish blue color so let's check that so this is what our background is so which is correct now let's say i want to change the color of my login button so let's see what is the color at the present so here this is the color of my login button for now and let's say please change the color of login button to red okay so let's hit enter so it has given the code to achieve the same but to apply this change it didn't give the apply option here neither the accept thing so now let's ask can you apply these changes in the relevant files okay so i hope this time we have the apply yes so this time we have this apply so let's apply this so it is now showing all the changes and let's accept this okay so let's open the page again so i'll again go to the browser and i'll refresh this page okay so the code worked so now the login button is red now you saw that how we can use this chat option here and uh, this chat option is not same as composer like in the last video we had edited multiple files in one go but through chat option we can edit the code one by one now here similar to composer we can mention different things using the at the rate so these are the things like the web code base notepad git code folders files so all the things like we have seen in composer so now i hope you would have understood how to use this chat option in cursor ai editor and now if you are interested to learn more about these things then do subscribe the channel and do hit the like button if this video was useful to you